Repeaters extend the reach even further. Powerful relay stations that take a signal and rebroadcast it, allowing simple handheld radios to communicate across entire regions. Then there are the extremes. Moonbounce communication involves aiming a signal at the moon, letting it reflect off the lunar surface and receiving it back on Earth. It's one of the most extraordinary demonstrations of what disciplined communication and engineering can achieve. Amateur satellites do something similar. Acting as orbiting relay stations, they briefly connect operators hundreds or thousands of miles apart as they pass overhead. But perhaps the most important role amateur radio plays is one most people never think about until they need it. When disasters knock out power, internet and phone networks, amateur radio often remains. Trained operators step in to pass critical information between emergency services, shelters and communities. In those moments, clarity matters, calm matters, knowing how to speak and how to listen matters. And this is where amateur radio quietly teaches something deeper. It trains people to communicate with intention, to speak clearly, to respect airtime and to listen before transmitting.